everybody, and welcome to another exciting installment of Wrestling Rampage. The two amigos are back. We're back right here on Wrestling Rampage, back with another video. As you guys know, we're right here by the title, man. Uh, uh, we found some really good deals. Now, um, this weekend, or last weekend, I should yeah. say. But uh, we went to, uh, we decided, because uh, I was off Friday, and we were going to go uh, do some stuff on Saturday. So we're sitting there thinking, we're like, it. we want to go to the flea market and look around, right, Tommy? You yeah. Know, you know, you you were all excited. You oh, were yeah. You were fucking into yeah, it. Yeah, right? I was ready. You were ready, right? So we get up about, what was it, 8.30, yeah. almost 9, and uh, we're like, fuck yeah, we're going to go do this, right? And uh, so we we got up pretty early to go do it, and on our way... It's fucking raining. To, yeah, on our way to the fucking flea market, it starts to fucking rain. And, and what does saying, everyone do? Pack up. Yeah, everybody's packing up, and we're sitting there like... Well, this was a waste of well, well, this sucks. And no, we did not find nothing at the flea market. Well, of course not. When everyone's packing up, so we decided, uh, you know, let's go, let's go look around at different places. So we looked at some pawn shops. I actually have some pawn shops, so we looked at some thrift stores. Uh, found something at the thrift store, <coughs> um, and then we found some stuff at Pellers Mall, which is what pretty much this video yeah. is going to be titled as. But nonetheless, it's pretty much just pickups that we made that yeah. day. But. Um, yeah, we decided, uh, yeah, let's go look around, see what we can find. Tommy, you want to go first? Yeah, I'll go first. As you see, I got the thank you bag right here. You see, thank you, bitch. <laughs> thank you, bitch. That's what it says. Thank you, bitch. Now, uh, now you got all this from... Uh, Peddler's Mall. Peddler's Mall. The there Peddler's was a, Mall. There was a guy that had a... Yeah, tell him that. Uh, he had a new... There was a person with a new booth there, and mm -hmm. he had, like, wall-to-wall -wall of DVDs. Yeah, he had a whole shitload. And cheap, and, too. And cheap as hell, too. But, you know, then again, I didn't want to spend too much money. Yeah, I didn't either. either. So, uh, now, once you see some of the prices for them, uh, not that bad of a deal. Guys. Yeah. And we go. First one I picked up was... Nutty Professor 1 and 2. Now, you love Nutty Professor. Oh, yeah. I love this fucking movie. So, it's two movies in one. It's uh, The mm -hmm. Nutty Professor and The Nutty Professor 2, The Clumps. Yeah. So, so I got one and two. And it's in good condition, too. And it comes in this pretty case, too, by the way. Look at that case there. It's pretty cool. And so, and, the, and it's, a, it's only one disc. It's a dual disc. It's a dual disc. So the back, uh, the, the back is Nutty Professor One, and the back one is Nutty Professor Two. So. Yeah. So, and uh, now Tommy, right there on the cover of it, it says how much you paid for yeah, it. Yeah, it does. Right on the fucking cover, don't it? Yes. Yeah. And I paid for Nutty Professor One and Two, ninety nine cents. Ninety nine cents. Now currently on eBay, this goes for about five bucks. So Tommy, say four dollars. Yeah, I say four fucking dollars. Yeah, pretty pretty epic because yeah. uh, I, I I enjoyed the Nutty Professor. Yeah. Uh, Eddie Murphy in the '90s was on a roll. Yeah, Eddie Murphy in the fucking '90s was awesome. Now he sucks dick. Yeah, I'm just saying he's not. You guys ever anymore. seen that fucking movie Meet Dave? That fucking yeah. Movie did you see that movie fucking Norbert or whatever the fuck it was? <laughs> Remember that shooting movie? Yeah, that fucking movie sucked. Yeah, but it but in the, the last fucking movie he done where he was old as shit was fucking Shrek. All the rest have been nothing but trash. <laughs> he only lent his voice for that one. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, so so you say $4 on yep. that one? Uh, 99 get, get, cents is what I paid for. Get it for 99 cents. And, Next. And we know, and, and if we know anything about Tommy, he's... Yeah, a, you damn right. I, I'm cheapy the fucking cheapskate. He's cheapy the cheapskate. You're damn right. 99 cents for Nutty Professor 1 and 2. And I got to add to Jim Carrey, Ace Ventura, Pet Detective. Now, only yeah, uh, you found uh, when nature calls at at a pawn shop for ninety nine cents, and now yep. you got uh, pet detective for yeah, 99 I got cents pet well. detective for ninety nine cents. So I have uh, all the Ace Ventura. Fuck the kid movie. That would sucks. Yeah. I ain't paying fucking ninety nine cents for that motherfucker. So I got Ace Ventura, pet detective. Pretty clean, you know. Pretty good shape. Had to pick it up. Ninety nine cents. Jim Carrey is fucking awesome in the nineties. Okay, he was fucking great in the 90s. Nowadays, not that good. Yeah. But, for 99 cents, couldn't pass it up, had to pick it up. 99 cents, Ace Ventura, Pet Detective. So, then, the last one. 
class. Oh, oh, by the way, uh, Pet Detective is going on eBay for about $4. Uh, Tommy only paid a dollar, so it's a total savings of 3 bucks yep. for this DVD. So, uh, go ahead. Yeah. And last is The Mask. Brand spanking new. Sealed. It's sealed. Okay, brand new. And I, I want to show you something. Not for sale. Yeah, it says not for sale right here. <laughs> uh, I paid a dollar thirty nine. Dollar thirty nine for and it's it. Factory sealed. Uh, the mask, factory sealed, goes for it goes for about ten bucks on eBay, guys. Yeah. Tommy paid a, about a dollar forty, roughly for it. So yeah. uh, that's his whole savings of uh, eight dollars and uh, sixty sixty yeah sixty cents. Yeah. So. so. There was my pickups. So pretty much almost a total savings of six bucks is what you saved yep. on all that. So that's a pretty good deal. Yes, it is. Uh, especially for that mask to be brand new sealed. Yeah. Uh, now, uh, what I ended up getting, I got the, uh, what is this, uh, thank you, reduce, reuse, recycle bag. That's what <laughs> I got. And what I ended up picking up, uh, me and Tommy spent, uh, spent almost the same yeah. amount of money. Uh I ended up finding this, which I know... Uh, the same place I found these. Yeah, I, I found this at uh, Peddler's Mall as well, the same place I, uh, that Tommy found these. And I know that Charles Reed Fowler will dig this. Oh, yeah. It is the Collector Series of Clerks, uh, the 10th Anniversary Edition. Uh, let's go ahead and open this up here. So get out here. Uh, clerks... Just because they serve you doesn't mean they like you. A very funny look at the over-the-counter culture. Great fucking movie. Jay and Silent Bob are in this movie. Uh, I love Clerks 2. Uh, and this is actually a three-disc set. And it comes with the insert, so that's, so that's fucking awesome. But, uh, yeah, and the discs are in great shape. Uh, this was released 10 years after its uh, release, so that, that's pretty badass. Um, has the insert, which has some uh, different uh, little photos in it and stuff, which is pretty cool. Uh, pretty cool to me, which was uh, a word from Kevin Smith. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, and uh, this, I, I didn't even know they, they released this before, but they did. Uh, this actually goes on eBay, the, the, the Clerks uh, 10th Anniversary Edition. This actually goes for about uh, $10 on eBay. I only paid $0.99 cents for it, so it's a total savings of uh, $9. Yeah. So, fucking extremely cheap as hell, so I'm, I'm glad I got this. Next one is uh, we went to a uh, thrift store. Yeah. And we were looking around uh, the, the thrift shoppy. The thrift shoppy. Uh, so we were just looking around there trying to see if there's anything that we wanted or, or whatever. And I, I asked Tommy because Tommy went over by where, like, sometimes they have, like, DVDs, CDs, games. Uh, he went over there and was looking. And I asked Tommy, I was like, was there anything over there? He goes, no. I didn't want anything. <laughs> well, there was something over there. Yeah, but uh, I didn't want it. Uh, but Tommy didn't want it, but uh, I ended up finding this over there, and I definitely picked it up. It is for the PlayStation 2 Greatest Hits. It's NBA Street Volume 2. And, uh, yeah, this... This is uh, a game that was the sequel to uh, NBA Street, which I like NBA yeah, Street. Yeah, I do too. Uh, now, there are some scratches on it, but I'm, I'm pretty sure I can actually get this buffed out. Yeah. Um, I mean, it's not it's not completely ruined, so I, I can pretty much get that buffed out. I know I can, uh, so I'll have to pay an extra dollar to get it buffed out. And it, and it is complete because it comes with the manual. Uh, this actually goes on eBay for about 12 bucks. Uh, sometimes you can get it for more, sometimes you can get it for less. Uh, but the average is about 12 bucks. I got it for two dollars. So, not, not a bad deal. No, not a bad deal at all. So, we got some old school returns of NBA Legends, a uh, hookup for a four-man, uh, showdown, above-the-rim gameplay, bring on the... 
authentic urban courts and uh, all signature, all new signature moves. So yeah, I'm I'm pretty pumped to try to play this. I might see if uh, see if it works without me buffing it out, but uh, I might have to get it buffed out. But nonetheless. Uh, total savings of ten dollars for this game. Plus, I've been looking for this game yeah. for a little while, but I, I didn't. want We did pay find it at Game Exchange, but they wanted a ridiculous price for it. Yeah, they want. I think they wanted twelve or thirteen dollars for it. And I do. I didn't want to pay that much for it. Yeah. Uh, so uh, I only got it for two dollars. That's a fucking steal. Uh, e even if I got to pay the dollar to get it buffed out, that's three dollars. Yeah. So that's 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 great. And then the last thing is when we went to the flea market, we were searching around there, and uh, I mean, I mean, there was still a few people out there. I mean, I mean, it wasn't pouring down yeah. raining, but you know, when it rains, people are just gonna leave. Yep. And most of them did, so uh, didn't find anything. And there's a couple of pawn shops by where the flea market is, and I told Tommy, let's go to some of the, some of the the pawn shops. And Tommy goes, Well, we ain't gonna find nothing in there. Well, I didn't. Well, he didn't, but I did. Uh, and uh, I'm so glad I went there because it's one thing I really needed to complete my collection. Yeah. So I'm very, very happy I went there. Because uh, uh, that pawn shop that, that I actually found this, usually they ain't got shit there. Yeah, they're hoarders. Yeah, yeah. That, that, they're, they're, they're fucking, <laughs> their pawn shop looks shitty as hell. Uh-huh. And looks like they bring in a lot of trash. Mm -hmm. To me, it looks like. Yeah. But we went in there anyway. Uh, I, I did find a wrestling DVD there one time. I found Survivor Series 2005. Uh, but uh, other than that, I never found anything yeah. else there. Until now. And I, I got a decent price on it. Uh, it's the one thing to complete my collection. It's the only one I'm missing. Forensic Files Death by Poison. And it is spelled right right here, by the way, because <laughs> if you guys remember, <laughs> uh, Crim's a passion. But uh, uh, if you guys remember, I ended up buying the entire set of forensic files off of eBay, except for one, because they didn't have it, and it was this particular one. Uh, I bought it off eBay for, I think, 25 bucks. I bought the complete series, except for one, which is this one. Because uh, they didn't have it. Now, while we were there at that pawn shop, they had all of yeah. them. They had all these. They had this one. They had all the ones that I had. Uh, now, if I knew exactly how much they were going to sell them for, I probably would have bought them all again. Yeah. Uh, but, um, you know, of course, I didn't want to spend too much money. And this is the one I really, really needed to complete my collection. And it is complete. Now, at, at first, I thought I thought the the case was broken, but apparently the person that put the DVDs in here didn't put them in right. Yeah. Because it looked like it was falling out, and the discs are in, are in, are actually it, there's little scratches on it, but it's not bad actually because I've already watched it to be honest with you. Me and the old man watched it with the hot bitch on there that got poisoned. <laughs> Possibly was that, but um, uh, which hey, fucker. I yeah 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 fucking lucky fucker she was banging, but anyway. Uh, the person didn't have the disc in here right, so that's the reason why it, why it was falling out. But it has both discs in it, 12 episodes. It's the one I definitely fucking needed to complete my collection. I finished my Forensic Files collection, so that's badass. There you go. Uh, now, this actually goes on eBay, and the reason why I didn't want to go on eBay to pay for it, it goes anywhere from $13 to about $20. Uh, the, the cheapest I've seen was $13. The most I seen was about twenty bucks, but of course I didn't want to pay that much. So I seen it at that pawn shop, and I say, "Hey, how much is is this?" And she opened it up. She looked at it, and she goes, two dollars." I could I could get my wallet out fast enough. Yeah. <laughs> so when she said two bucks. <laughs> when she said two bucks, I couldn't get my wallet out fast enough. So I got that's it for a steal. yeah, it's a steal. I got it for two fucking dollars. So that's fucking badass, especially the one that I fucking really yep. needed. So. No doubt about it, so uh, I only paid two dollars, and I'm gonna go by the cheapest, which was thirteen. I saved about eleven bucks on it, so that's badass. And uh, my total savings for what I bought is about thirty, because of course some of the ones I bought were a little bit more than what Tommy bought, yep. but uh, nonetheless, pretty good deal for yeah, both of us. Uh, total savings about sixteen. I saved about thirty, so that's why you need to go to your flea markets. Your pawn shops, your thrift stores, go yeah. look around. You need to go to all those places. Yes, uh, go to go to. Because you never know what you're going to find. Go to FYE. Yeah, go to your FYE. If 
Uh, disc replay, if you're in that part of part of your yeah. uh, town or city, we don't have one because we suck here. Yeah, our, our, our shit sucks. <laughs> yes, they do. But if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to give us a thumbs up. If you guys enjoyed it, don't forget to like us on Facebook, facebook.com slash WrestleRampage2. Follow us on Twitter at WrestleRampage. Don't forget, if you guys want to send something to the P.O. Box, uh, for Mailbag Monday, baby! Mailbag Monday, you guys can. Joseph Flat, F-L-A-T-T, at P.O. Box 6005, Elizabeth Town, Kentucky 42702. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more great videos right here from one of the best damn wrestling YouTube channels going today, Wrestler Grand Page. Tommy, take it away. If you don't subscribe right here to Wrestling Grand Page, then I guess you just don't.